Senna. Pals. Continuing forward with Fallout Season 1, Episode 5. Here we go. That's a bar. Oh, that's his head. Is he going to be like a talking head now? He has not stepped outside of that mach- that that device yet. No. That suit. You should brand me. Oh, jeez. Oh. Oh my God. They're like little children playing. It is your most sacred duty to protect me. Do you accept? Oh yeah. Thank you. Oh my God. Okay, old suit. <laughs> I'm gonna welcome the cockroaches. And they see us return with the target. Hide some baddies. The T Boys. Yeah. Aww. Don't tell them the truth. Hey, look. Uh, oh no. Don't tell them the truth. Before we go back, there's probably something I, I, I should tell you. And it gets interrupted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no way they can have this conversation yet. Oh no. He's not. He's gonna be really mad. You lied. You lied. We can still be friends. No. run, isn't he? What did you do? Give him up. First night of Titus. Oh, he's... He died. He's dead dead. He's dead. <laughs> he's dead dead now. He's dead dead now. They're gonna kill you. Come on, they might mean they don't have to find out. It's the Brotherhood. They'll find out. Only if you snitch. Oh my god, you're gonna have to kill him now. I should've known better than to trust you. Oh my god. What is... Oh. Does he have the key? Because he actually studied. Oh, or not. Oh, wow. Whoopsie. Oh, my God. This guy's going to get himself killed. Yeah. Oh, no. Stick your head's mine now. Get back here. Please, 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 no. He's too Don't trusting. Oh my god, Thaddeus is gonna get eaten or something Absolutely. right now. Oh my god, and now the dog is going with him? <sighs> why would he do that? He's such an idiot. He's a sweet boy, that's why. Both of them are innocent. They're, yeah, they're both learning the hard way. Yeah. Because he's got his like lofty ideals and dreams and morals and everything. Well, there was only one of two ways it could go. Either he told him later and there's a whole bunch of backlash about that, or he tells him now and the dude leaves him. I'm surprised Daddy is didn't get killed. Oh shit, it's the cockroaches. That's grody. Oh my god, can they eat an entire suit of armor? Can they get in there? Well, they can break you out. Oh no. Where from? Oh god, they're- No, 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 no. Who did that? Is it her? You're yeah. right. <laughs> She's a good shot now. Well, I don't think she was ever a bad shot. Well, when she said she was a bad shot, she hit a bullseye. That's true, actually. She got some- Anger. She got some wasteland anger. She's working yeah. out. <laughs> <laughs> I remember that uh, man I left with with the glasses and hey, I'm looking for his head. That's why I'm here. That's um, I mean, that's why I'm passing through. Oh God, the water. I, I got right away, left in the sleeve of my armor. You can have it if you let me out. Practically every person I've met up here has tried to kill me. Well, he saved you earlier, right? Yeah. If you lose consciousness, we're both gonna die. Trust me, please. Please. Yeah. But what's your name? Why do you have to think so hard? I'm Knight Titus. Oh my god. Well, he's got to uphold the image. He right? could just say his name's Maximus. There's a manual option. He's just... I got it. <laughs> She's like, don't worry, I was part of the Young Pipers or whatever the hell. It seems odd that there's no way to do that from inside. I know. That's why they have a squire. Maybe that's like a fail-safe thing. But if the squire dies... Then you're screwed. Yeah. My army started using these after the Battle of Anchorage. And he's even got the tempered lining in this one. Which is... <laughs> oh god, she's gonna pass out. Give her the medicine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe the logs were falsified. Why? Why? This is the thing you're asking why about. I want to check one more thing. Can't we just go home? No, we're tuned in too deep now. We got to find out. 
They were trying to get out. What happened? We know what's in there. It looks like they were trying to get into 31. But why? All I know is, we're leaving. Huh. No, 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 I don't know. How do you get into 31? Don't you have to have like a... Yeah. A, an agreement on both sides or something? Yeah, I don't know. Do you want to block that off? It's interesting to me that they just leave that open. Norman? Chester? <laughs> right away. <laughs> Where were you guys? So have you two been? <laughs> yeah. We've been planting Plant tate potatoes. Potatoes. Well, run along now. Come on, she's been around the block a couple yeah, times. Yeah, she sure. knows. I'm pretty sure but I think knows. she kind of wants them to maybe find out. I feel like she set Norm on a path. <laughs> they looked so sus. <laughs> I had no idea people lived in those vaults. What did you think was in them? Monsters. <laughs> That's what people say. No, just regular folk like me. Man, that suit is just useless now. Yeah. Well, my squire stole something vital to the Brotherhood. I've got to go after him. Good luck. Just like that. You guys have more of those T-60s? Yeah. And guns? Yep. What is she Listen, along with them? I have a tracker that'll lead right to that head. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, that's right. In exchange for my help, then you'll lend me the services of five or six of your knights to save my father. So the thing I thought was going to happen with his squire is going to happen with her. She's going to find out at some point he's lying, and it's going to have some blowback. Yeah. You could have been lying about the medicine, and you weren't. Mm -hmm. Just you about his name. You collapse back there, okay. and you didn't. Tell, tell her the truth now. I get that trust doesn't come easily up here. The foundation is bad. <laughs> tell her the <laughs> truth now. All right. I don't know. I think I could maybe forgive him for saying that he's Knight Titus. I'd be mad at first and then she's I'd be inv like... She's investing energy with the expectation she's going to get a bunch of those knights. There's, that's not going to happen. We know that. Exactly. She trusts too much still. <laughs> He's setting her up. He could have just told her right then and there, like, yo, like, I'm not... That's true, actually. One day we will have the incredible opportunity to repopulate the Earth and bring order and civility up to the surface. Good luck. <laughs> you guys haven't seen what's up there. I have faith you will make the right choice. It's funny, isn't it? It's like the world falls apart and then this little microcosm. I just feel They're like still doing all the things. Crisis. You need someone with experience. Hey, it's your vote. No hard feelings, Davey. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, why do I feel like I want to kill you? The water crisis and the prisoner, just all the uncertainty. Really, it's fine. We vote in private booths for a reason. Right. <laughs> He's letting him know straight up, isn't it? They're still, oh, like, kidding. so good. Wow. Wow. Yeah, that <laughs> that's very noble. I wasn't expecting that at no. all. No. I just need help with the last 200 years after the bombs fell. The bomb stole when I was a kid. Is that what they tell you in your brotherhood? She does seem like the wisest of the bunch, to be yeah. fair. You thought you would show up to some warlord with no armor, no health, and expect them to just turn over a hostage to you? Did you really think that that would work? I have the head. Yeah, but we don't even know what's in it. That's true. Yeah. I come from a place where the world is what you make of it. Okay, it's not like up here. Up until I was six. I'm confused about their lifespan. I really thought that the big light in our farm was the sun. He said the bombs dropped when he was a kid. Unless that's just what the Brotherhood told him. Or maybe there were other bombs dropping. Oh, like, I okay. doubt that anyone's really learning in school. I realized it was just... Is it going to be something about his mom? Because his dad came from 31. And he became overseer. Oh, shit. With a 98% majority, Betty Pearson has been elected vault overseer. How is that possible? I'm so honored <laughs> to step into Peg McLean's shoes. Better luck next time, Rachel. What? Is it rigged? Are they just manipulating everyone? If she knows he was like investigating and all that, wouldn't she be the most concerned? <laughs> He's like. I she see knows. you. Yeah, she knows. She, she, knows. Knows. she knows. Oh shit. Oh. Like every single Good. other being is so scary Why out here. Why would you say that? Are you armed? No. They're armed. There's no one here but us and them. So? It's not safe. Give me your gun. Are you trying to f us? The gun? 
<laughs> okay, uh, I think we're all feeling some tension. Okay, she's gonna try and de-escalate again. Uh, so why work. don't we all take a deep breath? And they open fire. Uh huh. What the f are you talking about? <laughs> 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 How about on the count of three, we all raise up our arms? We only say we don't have any weapons, and neither do we. Well, either way, could we, could we just give it a try? It's like a cold war. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. I guess there's no way around. Yeah, just take your side, raise your arms. We're gonna like crab walk. Three. Come on, bro. Okay, there we go. Now let's little crab walk sideways. Slowly. Slowly. There we go. Oh my god, I'm nervous. This is way better than that scene from The Last Fantastic Beast. <laughs> I'm so afraid that they're gonna reach for a weapon. I know. Well, they'll probably see her weapon and her stuff. Oh. Oh my god. Damn it! Oh my gosh! Why? Yeah. Fiends. Fiends? We've got raiders, we've got fiends? Like, Is what's he okay? going on? He got shot. It's just a scratch. It happens all the time. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> he got lucky. That could have been his head. What's a fiend? Good thing he's got that plot armor. It's people who eat people. Oh, Jesus. Oh gross. my gosh. I hate it up here. <laughs> <laughs> it was so nice in her bubble. Yeah. Oh, Woody, you never stood a chance. You had to be from, from 31. Even deep underground, there's all this political, like, conspiracy bullshit. You ran a great campaign. I know. Must have put 10 posters up. Oh. When things look glum, vote for somebody from Vault 31. Why is that? Uh, I voted for Betty. Why would you? Sh why? What is He's wrong with this so man? Oh, awkward. <laughs> he doesn't know how to just keep it to himself. You don't think it's weird that we always elect an overseer from Vault 31? They did the same exact thing in Vault 32. Hmm. By all accounts, Vault 31 has more resources, better education system. But how do you know? You know, they got that phrase. When things look glum, Vault 31. It's a powerful slogan. <laughs> yeah, it's propaganda. You want to be free? Vote 33. Hey, hey, hey. You think 200 years of coincidence comes down to a slogan? You might as well be asking why everyone prefers Jell-O cake to apple pie. I don't know why. They just do. I think that's a bad choice as well, because apple pie is amazing. So if it's not at all worrisome, why are we whispering? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Norman. Steph, I actually was just heading out. We'll uh, pick this up later. Hey, sure. She's just moved in here. Steph? Mm. Uh-oh. What's it like in Vault 31? How's Vault 31 different from here? What did your dad tell you? Oh. Not much, actually. That's, that's why I'm asking. Gee, I don't know. Uh-oh. Maybe the mashed potatoes were a little better? Oh. That is what my dad used to say. Why all the secrecy? Yeah. Sus. Must be true, then. It must be true. God, don't give yourself away. You might die in your sleep. Oh my God, my head is spinning. I want to know what the hell's going on. Yeah, we need to get into Vault 31, man. I'm sure there's like a whole host of references to the games that we're just not getting. <laughs> Why? This isn't real, right? Why? They didn't teach that in your history books? You never heard of the New California Republic? 34,000 people lived here after the war. The entire purpose of my vault was to come up to the surface one day and and restart civilization. It, it's, it's reclamation day. It's what keeps us all going. And Yeah, it's been going. Lies. It's a false promise. It's something to give you hope. Well, if it makes you feel any better, it didn't work out. <laughs> what happened? Come. How far along in their journey before he tells her the truth? <sighs> it's not all for nothing, though. I mean, she's getting educated through him. Yeah. And it's better to have a companion than just be alone. People change their names all the time, so it's no biggie. It's 
Does our Geiger counter thing do anything? Wow. If that's the crater. What happened? It's the same thing that always happens. Everyone wants to save the world. They just, they just agree on how. I wonder if anyone survived. I did. So that was the explosion in the beginning. Well, not in the beginning. I mean, like, his explosion. His origin story, as it were. We should keep moving. Yeah, check out the wound. Oh, shit. It's worse than he thought. Yeah, he's trying to, he's trying to be, oof. Titus, this is more than just a graze. How did he hide that from her? We need to get the head. The head can wait. Yeah, chill, dude. She's got a tracker in it. Come on. I don't think our guy is going to figure out where the tracker is. They probably both stink real bad. Oh, yeah. I think everybody in this world smells terrible. Oh, <laughs> That's true, too. <laughs> They're not used to smelling bad, you know? <laughs> She's used to having a shower. And probably him, too. Hawthorne. Oh. We're gonna get some stim packs? Is that what they're called? There's there could be anything in there. In there. Yeah. yeah. Medication. First aid kit. Yeah. <laughs> That's loud. Maybe enter quietly. Lucy! Do some Metal Gear Solid. Nope. <laughs> That's not how ladies roll. Going through the ventilation shaft. Don't you know? We just get in there. Little John McClane. Don't do a Karen. <laughs> like, <laughs> you know, one of the great things about this show is it gets you asking so many questions. Yes. Constantly. And it's like slowly the fog lifts. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. What the hell? Oh my god. Oh no. What the hell? It's a trick. Oh my gosh. Thank you for coming, everyone. It is important to me, for us all. She's gonna to shut the door. see this place together. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Some of us will stay home to rebuild 33. Others will be moving into Vault 32 in the coming weeks. No. No, no. Difference. This place is cursed. I'm not. No. Don't trust it. I think it's about repopulating food. Oh, wow. Told you. Wow. They cleaned it up. Mm, I'm not moving what? there. Nope. The I, th the I think the conspiracy is 31 uses 33. I mean, um, 31 uses 32 as a, a place to gr harvest food, basically. They all grow food. Human food. Cannibal. People? Yeah. Meat? Oh, is that what they're eating? The the spam? The spam thing? The the cram? I don't know for sure. I'm just like, I'm trying to piece it together. Like, what is the point of sticking them in there? Great job cleaning up. The Raiders destroyed so much. But not our spirits. Okay. I'm freaked out by her. Well, we don't know anything. Betty? Okay, here we go. When my mother died, what happened to her pit boy? It was buried with her. How are you so sure? I buried her myself. Because I buried her myself. Wow. Me and your father. Hey, yay, yay! The way she's looking at him as she turns away. It's gotta be like some kind of cannibal situation. It's just gotta be. <laughs> We're because stuck on this. The, well, the guy with the missing leg was my clue. You know, it's just like, it's got, that's gotta be something. Although the show established earlier, the butt is the place to get the best meat. Are they inside a vault now? Where are we? It's okay. We'll be all right. Oh, they patched him up. I was wondering if anyone helped him. Where is this place? We're in the best place in the world. Are they in 31? Let's see the... Show me. I, it says four. I saw a four on someone's jumpsuit. Oh, damn. I, gotta ay, ay, ay. I wasn't looking for it till you said something. 
This is one of those episodes where people go, wasn't as good as the last one, but I still really liked it. Because you can't have everything be like a high level banger, right? Of course. Yeah, some of the episodes have to be a little bit calmer as a means to just sort of fill in the context between other episodes. So it's a bridge. Right. Um, you know, but I, I think that they still like had uh, very compelling breadcrumbs. Uh, I can't speak. <laughs> I, st- I think they still had compelling breadcrumbs in this episode where you're just like, what's going on? Where's what that leads to what? And so I, I had fun with this nonetheless. No, I I enjoyed it because I think it's dropping some really important clues as to what might be going on. And now also we've got uh, Lucy and Maximus teaming up, mm-hmm. you know, and it ended with another big question mark, which is what is Vault for? And also with all of the information that Norm has found out about Vault 31 and potentially like he doesn't know what's going on exactly with 32 and 33 underneath Vault 31 but there is something really weird and suspicious going on and so now there's a sense of distrust of the vaults and here's Lucy she's in her element again and she's so excited but it's like what do vault dwellers do to people from the surface if they ever catch them. You know? Like, what? Well, he wasn't tied up. He wasn't bound. He wasn't put into prison. He wasn't, but, yeah, they they weren't. But, you know, we don't know. Right now, I trust no one. I don't trust people on the surface, and I don't trust people in the vaults. So, the... There's like so many fascinating things going on. In the first episode, we got introduced to our our villain, right? We don't know where she came from. We mm-hmm. like she might have also been a vault dweller at one point as well. We have yet to encounter her again, but seems that word on the street, people are afraid of her. Yeah. Like as soon as her name was mentioned in that pawn shop, it was like, get out of here, you're bad news. We don't no, it's not worth the trouble. Get out. So she's got a reputation as being a, a badass kind of individual. Why? What? Well, like, what? What is the history here? What is the history with her and her mom and pops? Like, did her mom leave? Like, was her mom actually buried, or was her mom in on things too? Yeah. Like, there's so many compelling there's so questions. So many questions, and like, even now, I'm thinking back to her dad and his behavior in episode one. So many of the vault dwellers in episode one were freaking out when the raiders came. Like. Mm-hmm. They didn't know what to do. They were like sitting ducks. They were all just like, oh my God, you know? But then her dad just swoops in and like is taking out people like a badass. And at first I thought, I was like, well, of course you would. Your your daughter is in danger. Of course you would. Maybe he's he's got these skill sets because he's, you know, been out there and done stuff or there's something secret about him and now I'm just like Vault 31 what is going on with you? Yeah, I need to know. I'm still assuming some kind of cannibalism thing. It's like this idea that they have set up to keep people in check to keep the you know the pawns doing pawn things (laughs) you know what I mean? But really it's like the people are orchestrating things pulling the strings to just for control. He said he was a kid when the bombs dropped and we saw that. Yeah. He's safe inside the fridge. Is the lifespan longer? Because it said, uh, when we saw the bombs drop and the, when the ghoul was in his human form, that was 220 something. 219 years ago. Yeah. So is, the, is he, uh, like, is the lifespan much longer? Is that the implication? It could be that, or I just thought it was that there maybe were more instances of bombs being dropped than they knew of or that they were taught down in the vaults. They learned their version of history that whoever runs the vaults wants the people in the vaults to know. So they are controlling the dissemination of information and everything. Whereas up on the surface, a whole bunch of other stuff has been happening. And so like everything that she knows has been brought into question because like even their whole goal of repopulating the earth seems stupid now because clearly the earth or America has a population. <laughs> there are yeah. people. I don't know if it made the cut in uh, any of the reactions, but I, at one point I mentioned Seven Eves, which yeah. is the book your dad turned me on to. Um, I never finished it, but the, the premise of the book was that like the moon was falling apart. Yes. And it was breaking into like so many pieces that it was essentially gonna become like asteroids raining down upon the earth. And so they were gonna take a select group of people into space, kind of like Wally, to keep them alive and everyone else is gonna be left behind. Those people ended up becoming underground dwellers 
for many, many years. And then at some point, the people who were sent into space come back. And so you have two factions of people now. I never got that far in the book, but just the notion of like, these people go underground, someone's gonna survive up top. And so, you know- Yeah, you got, evolution, right? Yeah, yeah, so you get those factions of people who, who happen to survive the blast and they end up having their own thing going on. And like underground is a whole other world, almost like being, you know, in the ocean. There's all kinds of stuff going on with dolphins and whales we don't understand, we don't think about, don't know about. And so it's just fascinating to think about these two, you know, parallel worlds. And then they intersect at some point and things go bad. I remarked upon how funny it is that in the vault, they still have all of these things that as a society we hold as, you know, being important, like democracy, mm. like, you know, keeping things orderly, yeah. clean, yeah. having leaders and all of that. Whereas as soon as all of that infrastructure fell apart on the surface, then suddenly it was like, well, well, every well. every person for themselves, yeah. you know, like, yeah, there probably still are leaders. Like obviously Moldova is, a character that is a leader of the Raiders, and I'm sure there are other factions as well that have, you know, they're important people, but it's certainly not like how it is in the vault. The vault is like the last bastion of all the societal values, you yeah, know, and they're yeah. still holding on to that. And yeah. then, so it's just interesting to kind of see what happens if all of the rules disappear. And it's all predicated on a lie. Very curious to see where this goes next. Looking forward to it. Thanks so much for hanging out. I'm Jabby Kawai. This is Achara Kirk. Peace out.